Alright, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel and guys today we are back with another video. In today's video guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys can overclock your Oculus Quest 2. Now note this is going to drain away the battery life, not majorly, but it will drain the battery life to shorter. So um just that's just a little note before we get into the video so um before we get in also uh be sure to leave a like subscribe and turn on all post notifications um i really appreciate y'all support and uh yeah I mean, let's get straight into it so uh first thing you actually kind of want to do is um if you guys don't have side quest installed on your computer windows mac it's easy uh but for linux or Chromebook, you guys can go ahead and install it. Um, for those who haven't installed it, it's on my channel, uh, so uh, you guys can go ahead and you know find that and install it for yourselves. After, uh, run SideQuest, and uh, we're gonna go to. You're gonna be here, right, at the home page, and y'all what want to do is actually uh, hook up your Quest. Now, I'm not going to actually hook it up uh, because I don't need to do it for this. Um, I've already done it and I'm not doing it again. Um, but after you've hooked up your Oculus Quest, go inside your VR and, um, you know, do all the usual stuff like allow uh, files to be, uh, you know, yeah, all that stuff. And then go back to your computer and click on the little wrench device settings and tools. And here we can uh, overclock so first thing you want to do is set the levels for me right now it's not hooked up but if I did hook it up it'd be level 4 uh, and yeah so court it says that uh, some games will uh, for overclock after overclocking some games uh, my drain uh, your battery uh, faster so yeah, keep in mind um, here now this is i wouldn't say a problem it's more um that it depends it depends on on your quest i'm guessing uh because for me i had to play around uh i first started at 1536 uh then i went up because i wasn't lagging if you are lagging then you might have to play around with this and go change uh but for me uh 3072 works amazing and um yeah so for me i'm right here or you can also keep it on default and change the other settings um moving on uh by the way uh, y'all can read uh what these do uh this is you know gpu and cpu levels this is texture uh how textures will load inside the game uh refresh rate this is different uh usually it's 72 you can set 72 inside the, head, uh, the headset but um, I've selected 120 Hz it works amazing uh, now here is a little bit different you go higher it's gonna show better performance if you go lower it's gonna show better quality um, I had to play around with this specifically and I chose low uh, which is much better and the graphics looks uh, they look amazing uh, now this I really don't know what this does guys and I don't recommend you know playing around with it unless you've done your research uh but um yeah i personally wouldn't touch this but uh, yeah so to be honest this is all up to y'all if you guys record videos or i don't know like sending clips or tiktoks or whatever this is all up to you on um, this is the default and you can go all the way up to uh 1920 by 1080 1600 by 1600 too so yeah it's, it's kind of big but they all get the point um oh y'all for those who record videos we got the video fps uh yeah the video fps basically uh 60 is the best 30 is the yeah mediocre and 24 is the worst usually i'm i think it's usually recorded on 30 i'm not sure though but it's up to y'all uh video capture rate uh bit rate y'all know what this does it's the quality of the captured videos you can change this i think 
the more higher it goes, the more space it takes. Uh, I'm not sure though, uh, but do y'all researches before, uh, you know, yeah, so this is how to basically overclock. Uh, it's not really hard, uh, honestly, and to be honest, you gotta be sure to, how do I say this, y'all gotta be sure to be careful with these settings uh, so your VR doesn't lag or you know, go crazy so yeah uh, other than that thank you guys so much for watching if y'all want to see more videos just like this one leave a like subscribe turn on all post notifications new VR content coming soon and others so uh, be sure to stay tuned for that thank you for your support and I'll see you in the next one